terror in paradise. The tranquil turquoise waters off the coast of, name of the location where the attack happened, usually an idyllic haven for sunbathers and water enthusiasts, were shattered by a scene of chaos and fear on June 7th. Two unsuspecting swimmers found themselves at the mercy of a powerful predator from the deep, a shark. The attack, as swift as it was unexpected, left the victims injured and the community reeling in shock and disbelief. This incident, a stark reminder of the raw power that lurks beneath the waves, has ignited a debate about the increasing visibility and aggression of sharks in coastal waters frequented by humans. And the science of shark behavior. Understanding the motivations behind shark attacks is a complex puzzle with no easy answers. While sharks are often demonized as mindless killing machines, the reality is far more nuanced. Experts caution against attributing malicious intent to these creatures, emphasizing that most attacks are cases of mistaken identity or exploratory bites. Sharks, primarily visual predators, rely on their senses to navigate their environment and identify prey. In the murky depths, or during periods of reduced visibility, a swimmer's silhouette might be mistaken for a seal or other natural prey, leading to an unfortunate encounter. Environmental factors, a shifting baseline. The marine environment, a dynamic and interconnected web of life, plays a crucial role in shaping shark behavior and distribution. Overfishing, habitat destruction and pollution have all contributed to a shifting baseline in the ocean, altering the delicate balance of marine ecosystems. As their natural prey sources dwindle due to overfishing or habitat loss, sharks may be forced to venture closer to shore in search of food increasing the likelihood of encounters with humans. Overfishing and the food chain. The depletion of fish stocks driven by unsustainable fishing practices has a cascading effect on the entire marine food web. As the abundance of prey fish declines, sharks are deprived of their primary food source. This shortage can lead to increased competition among shark populations, potentially driving them to explore new hunting grounds, including areas frequented by humans. The intricate balance of the ocean's ecosystem is disrupted when one link in the food chain is compromised, often with unforeseen consequences. Climate change, a murky picture. The warming of our planet's oceans, a consequence of climate change, is another factor potentially influencing shark behavior. As water temperatures rise, some shark species may experience shifts in their migratory patterns or preferred habitats. These changes can lead to overlaps between shark populations and human activities, increasing the probability of encounters. The human factor, curiosity, and conflict. Human behavior also plays a role in the narrative of shark-human interactions. As coastal populations grow and recreational water activities become increasingly popular, the presence of humans in the ocean's realm has increased exponentially. This surge in human activity inevitably leads to more frequent encounters with sharks, even in areas where they were once rare. Curiosity, a natural instinct for many animals, can also lead sharks to investigate unfamiliar objects or sounds, potentially bringing them closer to humans. Conservation, a shared responsibility. Protecting sharks in their fragile marine habitats is not just an ecological imperative, but also a matter of human safety. Implementing sustainable fishing practices, establishing marine protected areas, and reducing pollution are crucial steps towards restoring the health of our oceans. By safeguarding the delicate balance of marine ecosystems, we can help ensure that sharks have access to the resources they need to thrive while minimizing the risks of human wildlife conflicts. Coexistence strategies for safety. While the recent shark attacks have understandably heightened anxieties, it's important to remember that the ocean is a wild and unpredictable environment. We must learn to coexist with its inhabitants, including apex predators like sharks. Education and awareness are key to fostering respect for these creatures and promoting safe practices in the water. Swimmers and surfers can minimize risks by being mindful of their surroundings, avoiding swimming at dawn and dusk when sharks are most active, and heeding local advisories and warning signs. The future of sharks and humans. 
The June 7th attacks serve as a sobering reminder of the power and unpredictability of the natural world. As we grapple with the complexities of shark behavior and the impact of human activities on the marine environment, one thing is clear. Our relationship with these ancient creatures is at a crossroads. By embracing science-based conservation efforts, promoting responsible interactions, and fostering a deeper understanding of sharks and their vital role in the ocean's web of life, we can strive for a future where both humans and sharks can coexist in harmony.